good morning students today we are going to discuss about the snapshot algorithm for fifo channel in the course cs8603 distributed system the learning objectives of this presentation are to learn about the concepts behind global state and to implement an algorithm for taking the snapshot using fifo channel so first we have to know what is snapshot hope you all know the snapshot in mobile so what is the use of snapshot it is used to record the current stage okay what we are seeing currently it is recorded so similarly the snapshot in distributed system captures the local states of each process along with the state of communication channel okay so we are not only recording the state of the process but we have recorded the channel status also what are the uses of these snapshots means these snapshots are used in the process of checkpointing they are used in the process of garbage collection and they are used to detect the deadlocks and they are used to debug the program so the algorithm is named as chandy lempert algorithm as i told the main use of this algorithm is it is used to record a global state for each process channel the main feature of this algorithm is this algorithm uses a special message that is a control message called as a marker so when it is used means whenever the sites whenever the site recorded its snapshot okay whenever the site recorded its state immediately it sends a marker message through its outgoing channels what is the use of this marker message so this marker message is used to differentiate what are all the messages are included in the snapshot and what are all the messages are not included in the snapshot that is the purpose of using a control message called marker message so we know that all the channels are following the fifo principle since the marker message is sent initially it is received by all the processes before sending any other new message so the role of marker message is it act as a delimiter so this is the algorithm so we have two rules for this algorithm marker sending rule and marker receiving rule so in marker sending rule so assume the process pi wants to take a global snapshot so initially it records its state after recording the state it prepares a control message called marker and this marker is sent to all the outgoing channels so marker receiving rule is whenever some other process pj receives this marker it has to check whether it has already recorded its state or not so if it has already recorded its state it has to record the state of cs mt and it again execute the marker sending rule if the state is already not recorded then it has to record its own state as the set of messages received along the channel c after recording all the messages okay it has to record all the outgoing messages and incoming messages also so we have three steps initiating the snapshot propagating the snapshot and terminating the snapshot initiating the snapshot snapshot that is the process pi initiates the snapshot algorithm so what it is doing it records its own state and it prepares a special marker message what is the name of that special control message it is a marker message then this marker message is sent to all the other processes and it start recording of all incoming messages from the channel cij for j not equal to i that is for all the incoming channels the messages are recorded propagating a snapshot for all processes pj consider a message on channel ckj so it sees whether the marker message is seen for the first time or it is received second or third time that is is it has already recorded its state or not 
if it has already recorded the state okay, it has to add all the messages from the inbound channels if the state is not recorded already it has to record its own state and it has to mark the channel as empty once it takes the snapshot again it executes the marker message it send the marker message to all the other processes after sending the marker message it has to record all the incoming messages as like as the marker sending rule okay finally when this algorithm gets terminated means once all the processes in the system have received a marker message you can terminate this algorithm all the processes have received a marker on all the n minus 1 incoming channel so totally we have n processes means we have to receive n minus 1 marker messages okay so a central server can gather the partial state to build a global snapshot that is the central server collects all the partial states from each process and each channel using the using these states it builds the global snapshot the complexity of this algorithm is order of e messages and order of d time it requires order of e messages and order of d time so where e is the number of edges in the network and d is the diameter of the network okay so once again the snapshot algorithm for fifo channel what is snapshot capturing the local state of process as well as the channel they are the uses of snapshot algorithm and it is named as chanty lempert algorithm and we have two rules marker sending rule and marker receiving rule we have three steps initiating a snapshot propagating a snapshot and terminating a snapshot and the complexity of this algorithm is it requires order of e messages and order of d time okay so with this we have concluded